I have a jailbroken iPhone 3GS on 5.1.1. I could not get iMessage to activate. Then I found the solution. What you will need is a jailbroken iPhone 3GS or iPhone 4 with Cydia on it. Latest iTunes installed on your computer and an internet connection. This method works on iOS 5.0. 5.0.1 and 5.1. Before you proceed, turn off FaceTime and iMessage in settings. Launch Cydia on your iPhone. Go to Manage. Now go to Sources. Tap on Edit. Now tap on Add. Type in the address, repo.binger.com. Then tap Add Source. Now go back to Cydia and tap on search. Search for Sam. Tap on install. Launch Sam and go to utilities. Tap on revert lockdown to stock. A success message should appear afterwards. Now tap on deactivate iPhone, clear push. Again a success message will appear. Just hit OK to dismiss. Connect your iPhone to your computer and open up iTunes. Once the synchronization is complete, open up SAM from your iPhone and tap on more information. If it says wildcard activated, you have done everything right so far. Now return to SAM's main menu and go to utilities. Tap on backup activation. Next tap on restore activation. Your device may respring after that. Reboot your iPhone, after that, sync your iPhone with iTunes once again. After sync is complete, go to App Store from your iPhone and search for iPusher. Install iPusher then reboot your iPhone. Now sync your iPhone with iTunes once again and then launch iPusher. Tap on test push notifications and wait for a while. It should say yay, push notifications work fine. Congratulations! Everything should be fixed now. You can now go to settings then turn iMessage and FaceTime back on and you should now see them fully activated. If they still fail to activate, just give your iPhone a reboot and try again.